questions. How, why would a mother do this to her own children? Those little girls were found unresponsive in the mother's minivan at a Montauk Park. Mom nearby, who's now in custody, awaiting official charges to be filed in court. And she's facing charges in connection to this double murder. Jada and Jasmine Campbell were just two years old. They always had little beads in their hair. They were so adorable. She kept them, oh my God, immaculate. Neighbors never suspected any trouble at the twins' Medford home until Thursday morning. You heard the baby screaming extra, extra, like, you know, just, just, it was kind of disturbing, but, you know, it was like, you know, maybe they just had a bad day. The day ended with police finding their tiny bodies at a park off Montauk Highway. Their mother, Tania Campbell, despondent but alive nearby, suspected of killing them. Who does that? Who does that? In a Facebook post for their first birthday, the 24-year-old writing, In their first year, they have managed to stress me out to maximum capacity and still make me extremely happy. Such a blessing and a heartache it is to have twins. I love you girls till the death of me. And I told her she needed any help, you know, but sometimes, you know, I guess it's hard to, to reach out for help. Neighbors were told Campbell signed the girls out of daycare yesterday afternoon. Their grandmother then calling police worried for everyone's safety. After a two-hour, 60-mile search, it was too late. They were the cutest. God bless their souls. And those little girls have an older brother who was not with them at that time. After this mother goes before a judge today, a police are expected to answer questions and possibly reveal a motive. And also, we want to know why an Amber Alert wasn't issued after this 911 call saying that mom was suicidal.